Hello everybody, welcome back to Tyler Sucks a Gungeon. I'm an idiot and we all know it. Uh, you gotta actually grab the bullet and the gun in order to kill your past. Isn't that ironic? So it looks like we're gonna do another hunter run today. Uh, I'm actually, I'm, I'm really sorry. I, I wanna say I knew and I just forgot, but I'm not sure if that's even worse than knowing that you just have to grab the damn thing every time. I did not know that. Like, I genuinely didn't. So, I mean, we learned, and we got a little bit of experience fighting the dragon. That was just horrible damage right there. Uh, I mean, who knows? Maybe this will be the run now. Pull off back-to-back -back dragon kills and uh, move on with our lives. We've been playing well, uh, just in general in Gungeon, so it's not unheard of for me to crank out a victory. This is now the third time, well, second time, this would be the third time beating the uh, dragon with the hunter. So I'm not saying that it's uh, impossible, because we have already done it twice. And I feel good about completing it a third time. I mean, we have to complete it a third time, so I better feel at least remotely okay with it. It's going to require basically doing exactly what we did last time. Uh, get ourselves a couple of good guns early, flawless some bosses, uh, get the HP we need, and just hold on through the final floor... I just have to come to terms with the fact we're going to mess up on the final floor. It, it just will happen every single time. So we just have to minimize our mistakes. Uh, you know, take some damage, but still enough to survive. You know, we did beat the dragon on what? Uh, one heart or something like that. It's not a hard boss fight. We flawless the damn thing. We can do it again. It's not impossible. It's just we need a little bit of help from the game. Get the guns we need. And uh, we'll drive ourselves to success. I'm more concerned, honestly. I'm more concerned about the 4th floor boss than I am about the 5th floor boss. Uh, and I'm more concerned about the 5th floor than I am the 5th floor boss. So, as long as we get there, our chances are pretty solid, in my opinion. But, obviously, uh, there's still a lot of factors that go into all this. And it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be a process in order to defeat all these paths. Eventually we'll get it, I'm sure. But uh, for right now, we'll figure things out. I'm gonna buy a key. Rubber bolts won't hurt you, but they sure are annoying. Thanks so much for your uh, completely useless information. I appreciate it a ton. And then we'll go find our item room. Uh, I'm really just looking for a gun. To use on the uh, boss fight. Yeah, the crossbow's fine and it'll get us through it uh, if we need it to. But I would love something else. You know, anything else that isn't like a crap gun. You now, if you want to give me an anything else that is actually halfway decent, like a legendary chest, uh, would feel pretty good right now. A normal brown will not, but the Winchester actually is not that bad, in my opinion. I think it's one of the better uh, crappy tier chests because like this thing does one shot some enemies so hard for me to complain it's okay uh we're gonna get a key back and also bullet time which will slow down time for us uh not necessarily a bad item in the slightest uh happy to have it it's at least okay uh for our first boss fight so let's do this thing we're hoping for a flawless i don't even know who i want uh it is the trigger twins which is fine uh we'll figure it out we're doing good damage to him already. We want to focus fire on one of these guys. And you know what? Uh, pop bullet time. It's going to allow us to slow things down. Get some good shots in. It's actually fairly useless. <laughs> but you know what? It's okay. I don't feel good about this situation that we were just in please i felt really really good to use that blank and really really bad uh in general in that situation okay one down should be easy now we only gotta worry about one of these dudes just keep your distance use your winchester and uh we're on our way to a flawless it feels fine get wrecked and we're done 
Okay, give me a good gun. Give me a good gun. I want a good gun. We got two keys and the blunderbuss is I or the huntsman, which I didn't know was a cursed uh, thing, but apparently it is. Uh, is the huntsman any good? Not really. I don't really care for it uh, in the slightest because it's melee attack thing at the end is just a pile of crap. I don't like it. So, yeah, I mean, not the best, if I'm being honest. We'll use it as a room clearer right now. It's still a okay, you know, room clear. I will use the gun. I'm not going to sit here and boycott it, but it's not necessarily uh, my favorite in the absolute slightest. Okay, we're good. Continue on. Uh, a second floor flawless would bring us into a good spot on this run. Get wrecked. That went a-okay. Minimize damage now. Uh, so we can take more later. These early floors are not difficult unless we make them difficult. So just don't make them difficult, Tyler. And you're going to live a happy, healthy, uh, hearty life. I'll use the crossbow for a little bit. I mean, that was just actually unavoidable damage in my book. That guy came in at the very, like, first second. So I call absolute BS. We got a special room over here. It might actually be the uh, the long room already. Which sucks, because I don't really want to deal with that yet. But I want this to be an actual special room. And it is. It's a gun muncher. And we might actually use it if we come across uh, better guns on this floor. I'll pop this immediately. We get a mustache. A mustache, a familiar face. I actually don't remember what this does. I know I've had it before. Uh, chance to heal when money is spent. That's very strange. <laughs> but that's okay. Uh, it's a, it's a blue chest item. Doesn't necessarily mean it's good. Who knows? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe the mustache is a, a top tier item in the game. But I'm absolutely struggling to believe that. Because it seems really, really bad. But who am I to, uh, say what's good and what's bad? I can barely even win a run. That went well. Okay, get the hell out of here. We're playing fine. We could play better. This is another special room. Who are you? Offer blood sacrifice at the altar. Uh, yeah, I'll do it. So we became stronger. That was a deal with the devil type thing. Uh, we got rid of one of our HP. In the hopes of, I think, becoming just stronger uh, in terms of our damage. I think that's actually an okay trade. It's going to allow us to deal more damage. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's an awful trade. HP means a lot to me. I, I will say that for sure. So if it harms a lot of my chances of a victory, then uh, we'll see. But right now, I don't see it doing a whole hell of a lot to me besides just removing my HP. Take care of business. I mean, I suppose our pistol does feel a little bit stronger. So, maybe it is doing uh, significantly better things for us. I don't know, man. I never really know in this game what the hell anything's doing. It's going to take a couple several hundred more hours for me to know what's going on in this game. Uh, we do have a special room here, which I would love to do. Use nothing but the pea shooter. Absolutely. The pea shooter is awful, but it doesn't mean I cannot uh, use it properly. Especially, this is a very easy room. There might be more enemies coming shortly, but no, there absolutely wasn't. So, sure, uh, we'll, we'll Winchester here, and then we'll come on back, say hi to this guy. He gave me the Mega Dowser. I mean, honestly, this was just the stupidest waste of my time in this universe, but... I mean, the Mega Dowser is awful. And I see no reason to ever use this gun outside of memeing for part of this room. I would also like... I'm in a corner. I would like to not be in the corner, first of all. Okay, am I actually a potato aim? What am I doing? Okay, come on. Get out of here. <laughs> that, was a, uh, that was a journey and a half. 
Give me the goods in here. What the hell is this? Gas mask. Grappling hook. Uh, I mean, they could be good. I think I'm going to take it upon myself to buy some armor. A little bit of HP never hurt nobody. Don't mean a thing without that HP. It's not exactly how the song goes, but we're going to pretend that's how it goes for right now. Get destroyed, get destroyed, get destroyed, get destroyed, get destroyed, get destroyed. Okay. Bang. Bang. And I one of you. Don't mind if I do. Get the hell out of here. Uh, we can handle Gungeon now. I've never been more confident in my abilities to just completely take this game uh, and destroy it. We have the skill to win this game now. In the past, I was like, I'm trash at Gungeon. I've gotten better. You all can't deny that. I'm a formidable Gungeon player now. And I will prove the world. Prove to the world that I'm fantastic. The Colt 45 is a good gun. I actually really, really like this gun. Uh, I think we should... You know what? No, I know exactly what we should do. We should come up here. We should use this freaking gun muncher. We don't need the Mega Dowser, and frankly, we probably don't need the crossbow if we have the Winchester. So come over here, Mega Douse this man, and this guy could give us anything. Uh, so I'm hoping it gives us something good. Come on, give me a goodie. He's giving us a shotgun. I mean, at this point, I kind of wish we threw in the uh, the other thing that's basically a shotgun. But oh well, we'll use the cold 45. I hate my chances uh, in this room. I'm not good against the ammo conda. So, it's basically a hope and pray kind of uh, kind of room here. Yeah, okay, that went well. I don't know why ammo conda just does not work in my brain. I cannot beat this boss uh, on a flawless. So... Sucky, but we move on. Wow, I'm actually super potato quality. I'm actually the worst human being. Do not ruin your chances at victory in the second floor of the game. I know you don't have an insanely good run right now, but it is still like better than some. A regular shotgun is actually not bad, but... I was kind of hoping for something a little bit more robust. I'm not going to lie. I'm losing so much damage. Or so much HP. I'm also tap shooting. A lot of people told me to tap shoot. And I, I suppose I understand why. Because we do significantly more damage quicker. But still a little sucky. What are you? The Void Marshal. Uh, it's pretty bad. If I'm being straight up. is like actually a pretty horrible gun. So, we'll head on down with a little bit of sadness because this run is not going very well. But that's okay. We'll figure it out. There's still, you know, three more floors that we can take by storm and do good things to. And by that, I mean bad things for enemies, but... It's just like, this gun is bad. It doesn't really do any damage. It's taken me forever to kill enemies with it. I suppose maybe the damage is good. I Why did it do, like, good damage partially there and then bad damage every other time there? Do I have to be, like, up close to hit with this thing for good damage? Is it the closer you are, the more damage you do? I don't understand this gun. But that's fine. We'll continue on. Right, let me use the Winchester a little bit more. It no longer one-shots these guys, which makes me a little bit angry. I'm actually so bad at this game. Why have I all of a sudden evolved the potato quality Gungeon? Get out of here, buddy. Don't you know I don't want you here? You mean nothing to me as a human being. There was rocks right there. Get me out of here. Give me the HP and then get me out of here. Okay, I mean, we're playing poor. Uh, we're getting poor stuff. There's really no positives to the run right now besides our Colt 45 that we uh, probably should be saving for boss fights, if I'm being straight up. So as a whole, uh, just a disaster run. 
And maybe I'm uh, underrating the Huntsman. Is this the gun we should be using? I don't really think so, but maybe I'm wrong. I could be wrong. I, there's a chance that I'm horrible at everything. I mean, we already knew that, but... I suppose the Huntsman is doing okay damage. Maybe this is the gun that we should use. It's at least formidable to use. We do have the shotgun as well. I don't know why. I, I Using a shotgun in this game never really feels good to me. What do you got, shop? Give me the goods. There's actually, like, barely anything here. There's the drill for 9,999, which, uh, it's gonna take a little bit for us to get there. All things considered. Get destroyed. Continue on. Where are we going? There's the boss fight. Okay, uh, we do have another item room, which I will go to first. We're stacking up money. Uh, we'll eventually just have enough money to buy the damn drill if they don't give us anything to spend it on. We could buy a key for, uh, cheap. At least cheaper than it will be on the next floor. Might be a smart idea. Or it's just a waste of my time to even do it. I don't expect the flawless on this floor. Mainly because it's hard. You know, third floor bosses are usually no joke. And we don't exactly have the guns to carry us. That could all change right here, but... I mean, it could all change right here. It's an okay gun, the Magnum. Okay. We have more item rooms. We should go to the shop and we should buy a, uh... We should buy a key. And then, you know what? I'm gonna go fight the boss. This is a stupid idea, but... Why wouldn't I right now? It's Tanko. The Magnum's good damage, but... It ain't good enough damage to beat the tank with a flawless, so... Maybe we'll switch over to uh, a regular shotgun for the rest of this fight. We are gonna fully complete this floor, at least, like, to an extent where we can go find the item room. I, I'm, I'm actually scared out of my mind right now. I think there's a legitimate chance we lose this uh, run right here. I know that that's a little bit dramatic as we've been hit once, but this fight is hard. And the run ain't really giving us a whole lot of anything. Uh, what in the world is even hitting me now? I'm actually a potato at life. What in the world? Cold 45. Use this gun. It's our best gun. We should have been using this. We're also freezing up this guy. Please. You don't understand. I'm just a young man. I don't want to die yet. If there's anything we learned from the last run, never give up when you got one HP, buddy. Because we, we succeeded on that one HP swag. And we're playing well now. I'm clicking my life away. It's the We Believe Warriors. We got it. For sure, not a flawless, but... Two keys is fine. The Vertebrae K. They've done it. Alright. Uh, Vertebrae is good. It's really freaking good. This gives me a lot of hope uh, for the run. We now have some legitimate guns that can be used as uh, room clearers. The Magnum is a fine room clearer. It's a powerful revolver. You guys gotta go, because you're very annoying. You don't understand. This is about the time where you leave. You're kidding me, right? Oh, no, you're good. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. I still have another item room. It's here somewhere. I believe. Get wrecked. Hard to believe we're going on to the fourth floor here shortly. It does not feel like we should be. It does not feel like this run is good enough to be fourth floor ready yet. Although I will say, I think the fourth floor is easier than the third floor in terms of the uh, actual rooms. The boss fight? No. I think, I think the third floor boss fight's easier. But get destroyed. One and a half hearts. 
We really are, uh, we're being a little sketch on this run. I don't want to use the vertebrae. It is my boss clear right now. You're kidding me, right? Am I really this bad? Stop. Stop. Okay. Stop right now. Do not die to the freaking frogs. I, I have to pick a gun to re redo the thing with. And the cold 45 is absolutely the answer. Okay. Get in here. I'm actually scared out of my mind. Uh, we're on half a heart. That's not where I want to be. That was also very scary. Get out of here. Take this man right here. We should go to the shop and buy some HP right now. But I'm probably not going to because I'm stubborn. It is the right thing to do. But I am a loser. Oh, thanks for the two blanks. Would have been really useful literally any time other than now. This might actually just be the item room up here. Do not fall down into the ground, please. That would have been an absolute disaster, even more so than any other time in the past. Come on. Just be the item room. It is. Pop it as a heart locket. You've never been nicer. Come in here. What do you got for me? It's this dude. Double vision. It's so good. Uh, you gotta take it. Run's looking up, although I'm still frightened of it. There's no heart in here. Why you gotta do this to me? The fourth floor, two hearts, but... God, we just, like, changed the entire state of this run by, uh, getting this gun right here, vertebrae K. This gun right here, the old Magnum. Uh, an HP upgrade. Which we have severely been lacking. And then, uh, double vision is insanely good. Doesn't mean I'm not scared as hell. Just means I'm, I don't know, less scared as hell. I'm still freaked out as all anything about this life we're living, but don't even think about doing this guy right now. Get out of here. I do not want to deal with your face today. He hit me once. One and a half hearts. Do not be afraid to blank, Tyler. You should not be afraid to blank. If you need to blank to save HP, you blank to save HP. That's why they're here. A flawless on the fourth floor is hard enough anyway. So there's no reason to get all up in arms trying to get it to work. Get out of here. You, you don't understand. You can't be here. You can't be here either, but especially not the little dude shooting. Continue on. We're playing better than we were. That was horrible. And this was also horrible. I, I'm actually potatoing so hard. I'm, I'm so done with my life. Uh, this run sucked. <laughs> there was actually nothing good going on except for the damn vertebrae that I probably should have been using instead of a shotgun. Oh, God, it hurts. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, remember to smack that like button. We'll be back in the next video. Adios. Goodbye.